2020 Mustang Shelby GT500 officially tops out at 180 miles per hour due to an electronic governor at that speed. Just in case you were wondering, the last generation GT500 topped out at over 200 miles per hour. To help showcase that capability, Ford's latest GT500 press release talks about the extensive testing and development that took place, including the use of supercomputers and 3D models to study airflow cooling for the engine and brakes, not to mention added downforce for the GT500 trim levels. With the optional carbon fiber track package, a big rear wing generates 500 pounds of downforce at the car's maximum speed. The standard GT500 still benefits from aero tweaks, however, with a hybrid wing spoiler dub swing that produces 379 pounds of downforce, also at 180 miles per hour. Up front, Ford says the new fascia increases cooling capacity for the GT500 by over 50% compared to the GT350. There's still quite a bit we don't know about the new GT500, including exactly how much power its supercharged 5.2 liter V8 will produce. All they have said so far is over 700 horsepower, but no exact figures. But Ford does at least say the Shelby will turn a sub 11 second quarter mile time.